A storied three-on-three -three basketball tournament is back in Flint, but there's one big difference for this year's Gus Macker, a change in the location. And some businesses fear that means they won't get the foot traffic they were hoping for. TV 5 Zane O'Mare is live in Flint with where the Gus Macker will be held this year. Zane. The Gus Macker is usually held here in Flint's flat lot. Instead of the cars and SUVs, it's basketballs and hoops. But this year, participants will have a different court to play on. The Mac is back. Back and bigger than ever in Flint. We got 171 teams already registered. Thousands and thousands of participants and thousands of people are going to be there. The Gus Macker is an annual three on three basketball tournament raising money for the Salvation Army Life Center. We have the STEM programs, we have music, we have art, we have sports, everything that a child's heart would imagine. It's why we're doing this fundraiser. In addition to the tournament, there's also slam dunk, free throw, and three point contests, as well as a free mini basketball camp for kids. It's just a super exciting, electrifying atmosphere. And instead of hitting the hardwood, participants are playing on pavement. The location, different this year. Because of the Saginaw Street brick repair project wrapping up so close to the weekend, the Gus Macker is now being held at the county lot at 610 Beach Street instead of its usual spot in the flat lot. They couldn't solidify, you know, the, the flat lot as early as we needed it to be. Businesses looking forward to the crowds brought in by the big event. The first year it was here, I, I had no idea it would bring in the amount of business it did. And it was amazing, actually. It was one of the busiest, biggest days we, we have in, during the summer months. Despite the change in location, Heath Hoffman, the owner of Hoffman's Deco in Delhi, hopes people will make the walk to check out the businesses that are usually just across the street. You know, we're a block away. People can still come see us and still visit, but I'm just truly grateful that they kept and, and fought to keep that here in Flint. And even though it's a competition, the weekend is a win for everyone. We're trying to bring back the opportunities for our kids to be able to dream again. We have to give them an opportunity to develop their craft. I had that opportunity. I traveled all over the world, became the number one basketball player in the world, came back to Flint. They'll give back to our kids the same opportunity. Again, the Gus Macker will be held at the county lot on Beach Street, not here at the flat lot. Check-in starts Friday at 4 p.m. An opening ceremony will be held Saturday morning at 8 o'clock. Reporting live in Flint, Zaino Mayor, WNEM TV5.